is Jenny and I'm your MC and welcome to Bayview Quiz Club's Clubhouse. Alright, so how do you guys feel about being on camera today? Kelly? I wasn't aware we were going to be on camera today. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Tim, what about you? I second that. <laughs> Alright then. Guests. Now I'm going to ask you guys to pick three promotion cards, which we'll be using later. Well, we'll pick them. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think... Yeah, we could, well, we we could do that. I think we know what we're going to do. Two more. Oh, well, this one. We... Yeah. Alright. Okay, guys, so this is our first 33 second challenge. What's going to happen is, we've all placed your phones inside this mysterious box. Without looking, one person tries to find their phone by touch. You guys will all line up. And if the phone you pull out of the box isn't yours, put it back and go to the back of the line. If the phone you touch is yours, then you can keep it and you can get out of the line. So try to complete this within 33 seconds, and your remaining time, you're allowed to talk about your club using the promotional cards. Any questions? No. no. Okay, and make a line first. And go! Tim, feel his phone! Alright, so I've dropped my phone too many times, so the slides are broken. Clock is ticking. Is it yours? Yes. Alright, Jeremy, you're checking. Okay. Another feel from here? Yeah, I think I know the text. Yours? Yep. Alright. So do I just grab the remaining phone? I don't know, is there only one thing? Oh. <laughs> is there a phone in here? <laughs> Do you get it? Oh, and time to stop. Oh. Is it your phone? Yes. All right, unfortunately we have run out of time, so oh, no. best of luck on the next challenge. Okay, so this is the 66 second sticky note challenge. What happens is, you guys first stick all of these on your face and upper body. All right, and as a team, you must shake off Collectively, at least eight sticky notes to win, but no hands allowed. All right, so be strategic. Starting in three, two, one, go! Oh. No hands, no hands! <laughs> this was a bad one. I'll count that as one. One, two. I don't know. Oh, you six left. <laughs> hey, that does not count. Still two. Use your hand. You can jump around, do whatever you want, be creative. Jump, you can jump, jump around. around. <laughs> okay, three, five left, guys, five left. I'll count that one. You already said you would count that. Well, I didn't count it yet. Okay, so, okay, five. Where are we? We give up. You cannot! No, time to keep going. Come on, three more, that's all you need. Baby, close club, you guys are not. Give her uppers, alright. That is six. Two more, two more. So close. Come on, come on, come on. You better smart enough to do this. Oh, that one's really close. Come on in here, come on, keep going on it. Okay, guys can help each other out. And you have 13 seconds left. Come on, come on, come on. Hurry up, guys. I don't know how these got more stuff. Alright, that's eight. Anyways, go, do your promotional cards. So, what do you guys do? So, Tim. Well, we are Baby's premier academic trivia club, and we every year we attend various competitions, U of T and EQT, other various provincial reach for the top competitions, and... Um, our greatest goal right now is to defeat ETS at something, so we're still working on that. We'll let you know when we achieve our goals. Okay, thank you guys. Okay, team, welcome to your final challenge, the 99 second rainbow Lego challenge. So right now, Sherry is blindfolded, and we have Kelly and Tim here, members of the club that are going to verbally instruct Sherry, the blindfolded member, to recreate this Lego structure out of the same pieces. And you can start in three, two, one. Okay, so you should feel five pieces in front of you. Oh, All right, yeah, that's five. Um, okay. So find the biggest piece. It's the two by four. No, it's not that one. That's two by two. That's yeah, one no, by no, four. No. Yeah. Yes. No, 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 yes, 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 no. no. 
It's by your left hand. Yes. And try yep, that one. Or that one. So no, no, that one. Yeah. And then put it onto the brick. No. Yep. Yep. Wow. Good job. All right. Now reach in front of you with your right hand. Yes, that piece you just touched to your left. That piece. Yes. All right. Now put it near the top right. Yep. Almost. All right, you guys have. Woo! Time is up, but you can't complete the challenge within this time. Fortunately, we have no more time left for you to do your final portion of car. But that was a very good effort, Cherry. Good job. Okay, so thank you to our three wonderful contestants from Baby Quiz Club today. To do your marvelous efforts, we're going to give you 15 seconds to tell us about your favorite anecdote. We will be timing, so make it brief and interesting. Alright, let's take this one. Um, Kelly. Kelly. 15 seconds, really. 15 seconds? Yeah. So one of the main things to keep in mind when you're picking a quiz club is that you have to stay on top of your game. So one time, an opponent from another school, he got very upset that he was losing and got progressively more and more infuriated until he... I, I don't remember what the <laughs> anecdote <laughs> I don't know Wait, what the anecdote is. Why don't you tell an anecdote about this book? So he just randomly appears. Yeah, <laughs> just... What am I supposed to do? Uh, tell him your favorite anecdote. Alright, so my favorite anecdote for uh, Baby Quiz Club is that one time we all went downtown for uh, quiz bowl practice and we had lunch at probably the worst restaurant <laughs> I've ever eaten at in my entire life where the noodles were crunchy and the sauce was way too runny. It was horrible. Alright, thank oh. you very much for joining us today, Baby Quiz Club, and we will see you next time on Clubhouse.